everybody, I'm Tony Fleming from Fleming's Ultimate Garage. Thanks for joining me on today's video. We are looking at one of my favorite cars. I'm gonna be honest with you, man. It's, uh, if you've never owned an F-Type, they are, first off, they're fast. Second, they handle amazing. Third, they are great good looking. And they're not just great looking, they're smoking looking. So anyway, if you haven't owned one, uh, we sell a lot of these because A, they're a great value, and B, we kind of see these as a future collectible car, and I'll tell you why. When you have these gas-powered cars that are well-built, high performance, and able to be able to use like on a, on a daily basis, uh, that's really good. So this is exactly what you want. Um, and we're talking about high-end features of these cars, right? I don't want to spend two hours running down the list of all of the safety features, the performance and those things. I want to show you the quality of this particular car. I want to give you an option on wheel color and uh, find a way to get it in your garage. All right, so I like to talk about paint quality because pictures can give you a false sense of how nice a car is. Like I know this car was garaged at home, garaged at work, super low miles, right? It's also black metallic, which is an extra cost paint, and it looks amazing. What I want you to see is how to see good paint. I like to show people how to do that. So for instance, the first thing you should do is look and see that you can see the ceiling and all the beams in the paint there, right? That's an important piece. You say, Tom, why is that a big deal? Who cares about your ceiling? Exactly. I don't care about my ceiling. What I care is that you can see it in there, right? That means it's crystal clear that means it's good paint the clearer the image the better the paint is second we got this tiny little font here that I uh, read off of and I like to show this and I show you how crystal clear that is so when you can see every letter in there crystal clear right that's exactly what you want in uh, a car. That gives you an idea of how great the paint is. Photos can make pictures look good. Video shows us what we really have. All right, so I like to look under here, and this is what a luxury car does, right? A luxury car, these little tiny details. I get this all the time. Hey, that's a great looking car, but people don't really know why it's a great looking car. The front end of this car is great looking. This opening the way it does is just a tiny little something that makes a luxury car a luxury car. Supercharged, all aluminum V6, right? Eight-speed automatic. You are already set up for a, a car that goes fast, handles well, and runs well too. And they sell some upgrades too. If you want to, you can wick up the power, another 100 horsepower on these if you want some extra juice. Uh, that'd be pretty impressive. And the last piece of this is I like to buy cars a certain way. First off, I look at the tires when I buy a car. And the reason I look at the tires is because if it's my car, I'm going to buy the best tires I can for it. If I'm looking to dump it and flip it, right, uh, and just get rid of it, I'm putting the cheapest tire I can. This has a beautiful set of uh, Contis on it, right? Another feature. All of the decals from the factory are still in all their places. Why is that important? Well, if the car was in an accident, they would replace these pieces and they wouldn't be able to get these decals to put back on, right? That's a good indication of the quality of the car that you're getting, that somebody really loved this car and it wasn't abused. All right, the styling of these cars back here is the other thing I love about them. Whether you get the coupe or the convertible, they're just beautiful. I love the twin exit exhaust. Again, the black metallic paint. This right here uh, is uh, removable, and maybe we'll just take that off. You don't have to have that on there. This is a functional car, right? First off, it's a very fast car, but it's also a car that you can use on every day. This is a rear spoiler right here. This pops up automatically once you hit around 70-ish miles an hour, all right? The trunk here, the top is down, so there's less room when the top is down, but when it's up, uh, there's tons of room in the trunk. But uh, when it's down, you can still put your soft luggage and things like that in here. And there's a tiny little bit of room behind the seats, but mostly everything would be done inside here, but it's finished, right? They give you lighting for outside here. You may say, well, Tony, this is not a big deal. What do you care about lighting? Well, I'm gonna tell you that that this, that's what thought was given to this, is why I say these things. When somebody lines the trunk lid here, many cars don't have this extra little piece for sound deadening and making a car a nicer car. This has a beautiful uh, well in here for uh, the owner's manuals or books or whatever you want to put back there. Tons of room for that stuff. It's just detail stuff like that to me, says uh, a little bit nicer car. And it closes so nicely. I like Amber to walk up and show you kind of what you're looking at when you walk up to your car. This is just a great looking car. Like even like stuff like this, these side vents here, right? Uh, the calipers painted, the little uh, red part of the, uh, the wheel there. Anyway, once we get inside the car, while the car is fabulous outside, it's really where it shines is in here because, because, 
All right, detail stuff. Alcantara and leather interior, right? Uh, and then once we turn on the heating and ventilation, this rises up automatically right here, okay? Uh, then we have our screen here, which is really nice. I don't know if it turns on when the car is not running, but uh, all of the navigation, uh, and then you could preset a lot of nice things. This has uh, the exhaust system on it too, which is super cool. You can actually set it up so uh, the exhaust, it has two different modes of exhaust. It has quiet exhaust, like I'm going to, I'm coming in late or whatever, and then it has the performance exhaust, so you don't have to buy a performance exhaust system that's already built in the car, saving you a couple thousand bucks, right? Um, you can also set the modes that the way you want it to drive. You go in and you program in. You like the steering a little bit heavier. You like the suspension a little softer, but you want the exhaust on all the time. Boom. You set it for your custom thing. You hit this button when you get in, and you're ready to go. You don't have to do anything. 200 mile an hour speedometer. They knew this car would be fast, and it is fast, right? It's got a full power convertible top that goes up very quickly. Also, goes down very quickly, and that's my point. My point is when you buy a car like this, what you want to do is drive it to work, and you want to enjoy the fact that you can get in it, throw the top down, and enjoy some nice time by yourself. This has a Meridian sound system in it, which is their top of the line 15,000 speaker sound system. I'm kidding, but you know what I mean by that. Uh, and then the seat controls are probably the best part about all of it. You can move these wings in, in and out. These are adjustable. They squeeze in and out. That seat tilts, ups, down, whatever. Uh, it's got uh, all of that. It's also got a lumbar support for people that have back problems. This is really nice because it sits right inside your back. I could ramble on about the thousands of things. This also has blind spot monitoring. It has uh, a brake control. It has anti-spin control. It has traction control. It has a host of safety features. Like this is a very expensive, this was almost $80,000 for this car when it's brand new. And uh, with low miles of 23,000 on it, it's really a great buy. All right, I want to close up the video. If you don't mind, I need to read a little bit off of this list because this car has so many options on it. I apologize for that. It's hard to remember everything about every car ever built, so I try to do my best I can. But this has the vision package on it here uh, with a blind spot monitoring, adaptive lighting, parking sensors, front and rear, 360 camera, right? Also has the... Uh, the ultimate black metallic paint, which was extra cost. Uh, it's got the premium package with the jet uh, leather 14-way uh, seats, right, with memory and things like that. It's hard to believe that today these cars don't come with all that stuff standard, but they don't. I guess that's how they get in their price point, but this one here, loaded up with stuff. Uh, dynamic driving mode, the dual exhaust system we talked about, the fresh tires that are on there. It's state inspected, it's beautiful paint, it's triple black. Do I need to say any more? The last thing you want to think about is, do you want these silver or do you want them black? Let us know before, uh, before we finalize the deal with you and we'll figure it out. All right. See you on the test drive and I'll see you the next time. And if you don't mind, hit the like button down below. Call us 301-816-1000, right? 301-816-1000. We'll tell you all about this F-type. And I messed it up. So I'm now going to ask you, if you don't mind, to hit the like button down below. That helps get the message out. Uh, share with your friends. They might like to see some of this as well. Subscribe to the channel. we got new stuff coming out all the time.